thing. Uh, we had started an internship element within our uh, EM, EMA program, our Environmental Management and Assessment program. Uh, and it was an optional uh, aspect. We wanted to offer work integrated learning to our students, but quickly learned that if it wasn't integrated into the course, uh, there wasn't going to be the success we had hoped for. Uh, and so the project management course was really for us where we could embed that experiential learning opportunity through the internship. The internship itself sort of operated outside of the course for a number of years. Students would, would opt in or opt out. Uh, employers and industry partners that were critical to that course or to that opportunity uh, were substantial or not very substantial. So what we thought was best is to ensure that there was accountability for all the players, uh, the students, us as the academic institution and then the industry partner as well. And that was all framed within the course, the project management course. Uh, so for us, that was an instrumental aspect for success uh, in transitioning from a weakness within the program to a real strength. And the students now still uh, really thrive on that opportunity that we've provided. We really use the principles of project management to guide the student's internship. So the, the actual student uh, experience is through that lens. Um, but it also creates expectations for all the players. So even before the students come to our program, uh, we have an internship uh, coordinator that goes out and seeks industry partners that are interested in working with our students. Uh, that they will benefit from the project work that the students are involved in. We want to be very clear with those industry partners that we want them to benefit from this. It's not just something they're volunteering to do, that there would be an actual tangible outcome for them at the end of it. Uh, so that's the first thing that we do in advance of the course. We spend a considerable amount of time fostering and nurturing those relationships with uh, industry partners. We ask for them to come up with a tangible project that the students can work on. Um, throughout the semester. Uh, the project management course then, once it starts, the students then meet with their internship uh, industry partner. Uh, they work on a project overview statement uh, in collaboration, so there's a bit of a client-customer relationship that's built into that process. Uh, through that, they really do uh, a lot of work with the industry partner in delineating what that project will look like at the end of the semester. What are the deliverables that everybody's agreed to. So the expectation is then built into the student to fulfill the requirements as agreed to with the industry partner in advance. Uh, where the accountability aspect comes into play for us as an institution is since we're making it a part of a course where there will be evaluations, project overview statement, the work uh, breakdown structure, the tangibles of the deliverable, uh, it's up to us to ensure that the students have that industry internship available to them. Uh, so it really improved the accountab accountability aspect, uh, having it integrated as an evaluation tool uh, within the project management course was critical to the success of that particular uh, initiative for us and it's, it continues to be a really substantial part of that program for us.